Hello friend, welcome back. In our previous video here, we successfully created our custom 404 page. Now in this video, I want to create our another page because when this user don't have any permission, then that will be that display one of the 403, right? So here actually, I also want to do, I want to create, uh, loaded another custom 403 page. So that will be just like that same here, the same folder in our errors folder area. Now we have to create another new file. I click as a save as, and that will be be as a 403 okay that's all now 403 i want to create that will be the 403 blade dot php okay so this page will be just like our 404 i want to copy everything from our 404 and now in our 403 area i want to paste it okay i have already updated our all that at css jss now i only want to change that our title that will be as a 403 and here i want to display uh, this type of one of the message. Okay, I better copy it now I want to display this type of the message here that will be display as a user does not have the right the permission Great, that's all now if you click as a save all and now if this user don't have any permission now if you click as a refresh now our custom page is display you can see that is our 403 and also better I want to update that our title uh, title should be now as a 403 page now if you click as a save all and now if you go refresh it you can see this user don't have any permission as a, for our ad type that is the reason it's now display as a 403 great okay so how to create some of the custom message as per your demand i hope friend it's very much clear to you so now that is a 403 i have also discussed about how you can create some of the 404 page you can see that is our 404 page great so that's all our custom <laughs> page here we successfully created this page okay great great so thanks for watching i will see you in the next video